Yo, what's poppin' ladies and gentlemen, my name is Smojo and welcome back to another video. If you are new to the channel and you enjoy the video, don't forget to hit that sub button, leave a like, and comment down below what video you think I should do next. Without further ado, let's get into it. So during double oh, regiments, regiments, I don't know how pretty people, but I don't know how people pronounce it, but I say regiments, all right? So during double regiments, I farmed the abandoned backyard because I needed Dragoon gear and I thought it was a great idea for me to farm it for two hours just to see how many regiments I would get and see if this is truly the best spot for Alchemist Dodge, for the crystals, for the other things that you need for Dragoon that I kind of forgot. But yeah, during this recording, it actually took longer than two hours. It took around three hours, two hours and 55 minutes to be exact, mainly because I did some team ups. I went to the actual plays. I did some team ups there. And just during the whole waiting for a team up session, uh, that probably took more than anticipated. I think I was BRB a few times too, but I, I went a little bit longer just to make sure that I got at least two hours worth of actual farming for these numbers to be correct. If you guys don't know, the abandoned backyard is one of the best places if you're trying to get uh dragoon gear mainly because you need to craft dragoon gear and the regiments that you need to craft dragoon gear a lot of them drop from the abandoned backyard on top of that it's a really really easy dungeon and the boss has a super good strategy there's two strategies actually there's the two round hit strategy where you can kill the boss in two rounds and then there's a four five ish roundish hit ish thingy where you kill it in like five ish four ish roundish so yeah overall it's a top pick for a lot of wizards just to get the regiments that you need for the dragoon gear there's a lot of other dungeons that people choose like vigor's tomb or the devour or the uh there's like a few others that i can't name off the top of my head because i forgot but yeah there's a lot of other dungeons that you can farm but most people farm the abandoned backyard just because it's an easy dungeon it's fast and it drops a lot of uh regiments that you need to craft the gear anyway so yeah during double regiments there was actually a lot of people farming this dungeon so that was another reason why i just wanted to you know do this video i was really surprised with the results of the amount of regiments that i got i thought i was going to get a lot more of a lot of other things and i ended up not getting as much as i thought which was kind of disappointing at the end of it i got around 221 alchemist extract which was pretty good i was that was on a high number all right that was that was up there all right uh, I got 12 alchemist salts, which was very bad. I feel like I should have gotten more over two hours and double measurements. I really felt like I should have gotten more. Um, and I also got eight alchemist crystals, which was even worse. Like I really, I really thought that something was up, something was wrong. When I checked this, I was like, wow. Like I was super surprised about the amount of extracts that I got, but for the crystals and the salts, that just. That just wasn't it i'm not sure if i just got super duper unlucky with the numbers and maybe you guys got like a lot of numbers or whatnot but that's that's really bad but i have heard that this battle right here the abandoned backyard is mainly good for the extract which we did get 221 extract so it does make sense um but battles like the uh, vigorous tune the devour things like that they drop more than the abandoned backyard in certain regiment areas such as crystals and salts and etc etc i think Vig vigorous tomb is the one that actually drops a lot of salt so yeah or is that devour i don't know it's either one of them it's one of them yeah but yeah at the end of the day i got to craft my dragoon the exact same day so i'm super happy nothing to complain about um if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you leave a like and i also did a one hour farming for a secret tunnel and the, the vultures and mirage about cash potatoes i'll leave those down in the description if you guys want to watch those um make sure to leave a comment down below what place you want me to farm next i'm looking for new places to farm i don't know a lot of places to farm certain things so you know if you guys know a nice place to farm something nice then you know just drop it down below and i'll farm it for an hour two hours 24 hours who knows and i'll make a video on it and uh yeah without further ado i hopefully you have a great day and i am about to go to sleep it's really late at night thank you for watching everybody have a great day and i'll see you in the next one peace